There's no place like home for the holidays. It has been way too long. But getting there for Thanksgiving might require some patience. With nearly 55 million people expected to travel more than 50 miles. It'll be really good to be with my family again. One X factor that could always foil plans, the weather. Where are the biggest threats? The most likely trouble spots are in the Pacific Northwest, which is expecting snowy and windy conditions. And in the Southeast, potential thunderstorms also loom large. One of the busiest days to fly. That would be the Tuesday and Wednesday before the holiday and the Sunday after. If you're worried about travel turbulence, book earlier flights. They're less likely to get delayed. For delays or cancellations, call the airline's international numbers, which offer the same services, but less waiting. And whenever possible, go with a carry-on. If your flight does ultimately get canceled or you miss your connection, it's going to be far easier to get rebooked if the airline doesn't have to also try to find your checked luggage. On the roadways, where the majority of travelers are headed, what are the worst times to drive? That would be Wednesday between 11 a.m. and 8 p.m. and Thanksgiving Day from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. As for the feast that awaits. Cooking for Thanksgiving does not have to be chaotic. Google's top trending food related search for the holiday, Ina Garden's Thanksgiving recipes. I would say once you've made a turkey this way, you're never going back to the old fashioned way. As well as two big questions about the turkey. How much do I need and when do I start thawing it? Plan to have about a pound and a half per guest and the USDA recommends allowing one day to unthaw for each four or five pounds of weight meaning you probably want to start right now. Lastly, after you've gobbled up the turkey, it's time to start hunting for deals. The top five searched items on Google, TVs, laptops, Nintendo Switch, Christmas trees, and the Apple Watch. The most important thing you need to know, the price cuts are already here, but you need to fact check the bargains because not all of them are great. Use tools like Camel 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 to see a product's historical pricing or wish lists, which may alert you to price drops. And experts say electronics and tech are areas that you can snag some serious savings. We're seeing television deals, we're seeing deals on uh, Windows Ultrabooks, and we're even seeing some deals on, uh, on Apple Gear, which hasn't always been the case during, uh, during Black Friday sales. As for Thanksgiving, guys, the TSA has posted a list of items you can and cannot try to bring through security. So baked goods, meat, turkey, casseroles, those are all fine. However, gravy, fruit preserves, and cranberry sauce can't take those through security. That sounds like a recipe for disaster, but apparently we need to let the masses know. Don't try to do that. Don't what about that do. firm cranberry from the can? No. Yeah, 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 That's yeah, like yeah. not really a the liquid. Yes, 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 sliced. No, no cranberry. Sliced. There you go. All right. Thank yeah, you, Sam. It's like a gelatin. Yeah, I, think I, think it's so. the, I think it's on the I think it's on the edge. Gelatinous. Um, yeah, exactly. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.